Hello guys, welcome back to The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 1, Part 4. Um, so, we've just got ourselves um, kitted up. Uh, whatever. Sewn up. Sewn up. Sewn up, kitted up. Kitted up. <laughs> uh, and we just killed a zombie. And Sewn up from the dog bit us. Yeah. Because we got bit by the weekend. Oh, that's true, yeah. Alright, let's resume. As you said, I'm still not bitten. That's damn right. I never was. And you left me out here to die. You patched yourself up? Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from us? This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not carrying a baby. Enough already. Do Guys, you have any please. You left me no choice. You could have just left. Relax, Rebecca. Could have just Bring left. Her in, and I'll Harsh. Take a look at her eyes. I think she'd be a bit more motherly, really. Mm. Hang on, she's up the duff. You hungry? I said, like give him a silent treatment. Mm. Don't know if I gave me a choice, though. It's kind of zoomed in, unfortunately. My TV zooms in from time to time. It's really annoying. Mm. Only with computer games, though. I don't think it's in it. You normally can see a, the triangle circle and that. Yeah, true, it wouldn't have been that much. Maybe. Yeah, I don't like this TV, to be honest. <coughs> wow, it's near the end of the episode, by the way. little. Ow. How she looked. Their suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So. Wasn't a lurker bite? If it was, the fever would have already set in and the temperature would be through the roof. Can I see the subtitles though? Um. So it must be zoomed in pretty. Uh, it's gonna be my Mr. Choice. Never mind. Not a big anyway. I wish you wouldn't have done what you did. Oh, you can see it? I didn't do anything. Exactly what Sarah says every time I catch her in a lie. We put you in that shed out of concern for the safety of our loved ones. And then you escaped and persuaded my daughter to steal from us. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially. But once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. So you're right. Yeah. She knew how bad the world is. What it's really like out there. She would cease to function. She's my little girl. She's all I have left. And I would ask that you stay away from her. I'm sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. You're forgiven. Just don't make any more mistakes. <laughs> Harsh. Hmm. Mm, I'm not sure about this whole group, to be honest. No. Hey, uh, They're all very suspicious of each other, aren't they? Mm. It's all going to fall apart sometime, I'm guessing. Dramatically so. Mm. But I do like him. Yeah, and his dad. Yeah. It doesn't bother me. I can live with it. Wow. Nice. Yeah. Sure you're tough. What is she eating? Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry for, for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro. That was definitely not cool. That's quite big of him to say Nick's sorry. Been known to go mm, every once true, in a while. yeah. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. You were just protecting your friends. I get it. Well, I didn't mean to be so hard. Yeah. I just... Uh, big enough to say yeah. sorry then. Mm. Yeah. Okay. What happened? Nick lost his mom. 
We took care of someone who got bit. It was my fault. It was no one's fault. We thought we could control it, but we couldn't. And then she turned, and his mom was standing right there, and she got attacked. Mm, not nice. And there was nothing we could do about it. Anyway, hopefully you understand. I have to find one old Stan. Bad things have happened to everyone. Did you like my answer? Mm -hmm. You know, quite honestly, I cannot hear much of what's being said in these headphones. Oh. <laughs> Mine keep falling out, so we're doing well here. Yeah, and I can't read so, the subtitles, so it's screwed. You're pretty much on your own. What's your plan? I'm moving on. I'm thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. You can let yourself heal up. Take some time to sort things out. I might be okay. Everyone else will be okay with it? Yeah. They'll just have to deal with it. Wait until I'm fully recovered, I so, suppose. What happened to your parents? If you don't mind me asking. I mean, I assume what happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. They died. That's tough. I, uh, I lost my folks, too. Hey, I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have asked. My parents went on vacation. I'll say it's bad, too. With a babysitter. It's bad, too. I appreciate you being honest. Mm. We went to Savannah to find them. They were already dead. True. Wow. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. My bad, me? This is man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we all tried to make it. But it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. He told me to stay away from cities. What happened to him? The same thing that happens to everyone. But he saved me first. Lots of times. Well, sounds like he was a real good guy. He was. Yeah, he was. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch, and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in anyway. Well, get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. A couple fresh brookies for dinner? Mm, wouldn't that be nice? I thought that was his dad, he said his parents were dead. Hmm. Hmm. Could be an uncle, I think. I did suggest earlier oh, it might be. Still here. <laughs> Just I don't like her. No. I wouldn't be comfortable if I were you. Maybe you fooled everyone else, but not me. What? Who? Don't pull that shit on me. I'm not my husband. What? I'm sorry. I don't understand. Yes, you do. I just needed some help. Well, you got it. Now go. Whose baby is it going to do it? I won't. Do it. <laughs> no. I don't trust you. And stay the hell away from my husband. Oh, good blackmailer. Yeah, but I reckon it's her husband's baby. Do you? Hmm? Do I reckon it's her husband's baby at someone well, else's? Of course not. That's why she said it. But uh, whose is it? And uh, we could blackmail her to get her to shut up, but but we'll then. Might be pushing it a bit. Though. Yeah. She might try to kill us or something. <laughs> <laughs> you know. That would be good. Yeah. 
well, to be fair. She's nearly at that stage anyway, to be honest. <laughs> Something dramatic's going to happen fairly soon. Like I said, I think it's in almost the end of the episode. Really? Yeah, it's, they're about two hours each. I played over half an hour last episode. And Trophy? Yeah. No, I can't see what it says there. No. It's related to Glissa's TV. <laughs> I don't know why it does it. I'm sure it's a way of sorting it, but... I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last night. Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. Her bark's worse than her butt. What's her problem? Now yeah, she's got a lot on her mind lately. Bringing yeah, a baby does. into a world like this. Oh, she, she bars bars <laughs> Anyone teach you how to shoot? By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. Yeah, but not a rifle. Well, that makes sense. Less kick. This thing would probably knock you on your ass. Don't touch that. <laughs> Dangerous. Nick was about your age. First time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle. He lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me Uncle. shoot it. Really? Oh, no way. Hey! Why didn't you wait? Yeah. You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway, so I grab the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang! The gun fires. The boy nearly gut shot me. And of course, the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Because you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to <laughs> let her know it's nothing personal with you. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I apologized already. She accepted. Okay, well, I didn't know that. Let's just get to the river. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Oh, happy families. Leaving us again. I know where the fucking river is. <laughs> so that's his. So anyway, Uncle. I found that buck later that season. I thought the other guy was his right neck. Was his Brought it up for my nephew. sister's figure, and she'd want to freeze some of the meat. They do look similar. Speak to me for weeks. True. Sometimes you gotta play a role, even if it means people you love hate you for it. You should tell him that. Before it's too late. Yeah. Probably is. Probably is, probably is too late already. Uh -oh. Doesn't sound like a good Uncle Pete. Nick. I just found something. What? <laughs> the hell? Who do you think did this? Not sure yet, but it ain't your average gang of thugs, that much I know. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? Check those guys there. Mm. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. I'm scared. Yeah, some way. Not right there. Yeah, it's this other group. What's going on? What's other group? What can I do? See if you can find anything else. Like what? Like what might tell us who did this. Okay, so we have to look at dead bodies. Yay. This one's shot too. Through the head? <laughs> yeah. Check the rest. Execution look style. for ammo. We're running low. Oh, what if one of them singing? Mm. There are more out there. This wasn't no rinky dink pissing match. What was it then? Fubar. Where are you going? We need to get the fuck out of here. Gotta check the rest. What? Why? Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down? We gotta get out of here now! 
Jesus Christ, get a hold of yourself. Shouldn't we go get the others? Wish we could. But one of these folks might still be alive, and they just might be inclined to tell us who did this. We gotta do this now. Stay here. Keep searching these. This is a dumb idea. <clears throat> you know, Nick, I don't like this either. But sooner or later, you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever gonna give a goddamn whether you like something or not. Tony has to grow up, son. Whatever. Come no, on, Clem. But... You wanna be useful? Shanty. Take a look out on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this mess, just like baiting a fish. I'm on it. You always so agreeable? No. Good. You'll fit right in with this outfit. Look, just keep your head on straight. Oh. Uh, zombie. That was what you heard. Hope. Shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone we know. No. Good. Oh. Damn it. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. Krista, mm. not yet. I think it's going to be a lot more dramatic. Okay. <clears throat> He's going to be still alive, isn't he? <gasps> it's your bag. With Krista, the woman I was with, what happened to her? Please, tell me. Tell me. <laughs> Do it, and he might tell you. Yeah, I've got it. It's not mu much longer for this world, is he? Ah! Uh. Pete! I'm fine! I'm fine! Just... just lost my footing! Damn it. You got that? Damn it. I didn't go very well. Oh, he's going to flip in. Let's hope it's not a bite. Let's hope it's not a bite. It played the other bite. Oh, oh, there you go. Next time. What are you going to do? It off. Oh, I hope you don't have to do that. Yeah, of course you do. <laughs> That'll be fun. Someone's outside. Uh oh. Someone came here looking for you. A man. What? Did he say what his name was? We know uh, damn well who it was. Who is he? One of the guys we were with before. What's he 
he gonna do? Cliff Harry? I can't keep going. I figure we got about four, five more days to reach those mountains. We ain't here to rob nobody. Just relax and put the gun down, man. I thought you were dead. Krista. Or oh, maybe one of the others. Having that, that'd be more, even more interesting. Mm. <laughs> oh. Right. Did you try to save Krista? 83% sweet decision. Uh, did you kill the dog? 81%. Yeah. Yeah, I thought that would be okay. Did you accept Nick's apology? 87% did. Mm -hmm. Did you give water to the man? 67%. Ooh, not so much. No. Did you save Nick or Pete? 52% went with Nick. That surprised me. They went with Pete. Yeah, I'll point with Pete. So they did the same as you? Yeah. Yeah, yeah so the other, yeah. So the other guys went with Nick. And um, that surprised me. Because he was an ass. But then I guess if they were on 40 had uh, been the bitten, game, yeah. the survival choice, I suppose, is dictates go with the other one. Mm. Mm. Is there any more <coughs> than that or just those ones? Hmm? Is it just those ones? Yeah, I think so. Next. Yeah. And... Play music. Yeah, there you go, the end credits for the first episode of The Walking Dead Season 2. Um, yeah, good. Good, I enjoyed it, yeah. I think it will definitely get in more interesting. Well, at least I hope so. Um, oh god, that's going to ruin my monstration. Music is copyrighted. Ah <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, never mind. Who gives a shit? I'm not getting enough views for that anyway. It's got. Uh, it's got to be for so many well, seconds anyway. Thirty seconds. Yeah. Right. Um, thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next episode. Maybe we're not sure whether we're going to continue this or not, depending on the views. So give it likes uh, if you want to see the next episode. If not, we'll carry on off camera. Bye bye.